Where you at, man? Your house is empty. Ah, oh, hey. I had to kind of lay low for a while. Yeah, that nice Mexican we met. Me and T did that job for him, and we fell out. You gotta be joking. I wish I was. So where you at now? <sighs> Desert? Out by Alamo Sea? All right, well, I'll hit you if I find anything. Absolutely. Ah, uh, oh, hey. Trevor's got his wife. Trevor's got a wife? No, no, the Mexican's wife. What? <laughs> Shit, I don't know what to say about that one. Nothing. Nothing to say about that. Run! Run! I'm back! Coming, Trevor! Uh, bring me my coffee, I'm gonna cut your arm off. Absolutely! Who the hell's that, your maid? Oh, business partner. Good guy. Very loyal. Ron, Ron, that is Michael. And this is Patricia. Ah. <sighs> Listen, beautiful. You know, I'm sorry about everything that's happened. And I, you know, I can't guarantee no harm's gonna come to you. I might have to chop you up into little pieces before spraying your pulp mess down the drain, but I really hope it doesn't come to that. I appreciate your honesty. You are a good man. I can see that. You need your eyes examined, then. Ron, you miss me? Yeah, Trevor, a bit, I mean. How's the fucking business? I, I, I tried. If you're gonna give me a sob story, I'm gonna rip your fucking throat out and shove a turd down the hole. It's not a sob story. It's just not quite come good yet. But I heard about something to do with Merriweather. Mm, those assholes Big again. cache of weapons they got coming in. So I thought you might want to, uh, requisition mm. it. Fantastic! Let's go! Come in. Whoa, no, 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 not you. Sit down. You're a wanted man. Stay low. Now watch her, okay? She's a good lady. Let's go, Ron. Good to meet you, Michael. Fucking come on, let's go! Ah. <sighs> The weapons are coming in by air. We've got a plane over at the airstrip, but... Right, let's go! What are you going to do? We're not going to take out a private army on the ground, Ron. we got to meet them in the air. I... Uh, okay, well, I knew that you were pissed after the Merriweather heist, giving back the hardware. That! was bullshit! Right, right. So I've been monitoring chatter, tapping into Merryweather networks? Feels good to be back in the company of a professional. I gotta say, I got it. Now, I was expecting something a little more impressive. The late, great Michael Townley. Not so late and not so great, right? And no longer called Townley. The years have not been terribly kind. What's the end game, man? What's the end game, man? We had a good thing going without him. If it's such a good thing, where's my money, huh? Where's my consultant's fee and my big fat dividend? I want a franchise network, Ron. I want reward cards, merchandise. I want to make gun violence and drug dependency accessible to every man and beast from Hove Beach to Vespucci. I want country clubs and a depressed wife with blonde hair and a hot little secretary. Crop duster? That's the best we can do? Get in touch with my Mexican contact. Tell him we got some guns to sell. I'll get you on the CV. Right ahead of me. 
out here, bullying, reckless, totally selfish, do the things that make me me. Like kidnapping the wife of a powerful Mexican gangster and flying a crop duster toward a jumbo jet loaded with mercenaries. Exactly! Everyone's so hung up on appearances in LS, you start to forget who you are. And if you ain't who you are, who the fuck are you? crop duster, just enjoying the beautiful San Andreas weather. Unidentified aircraft, divert your course or we will be forced to shoot you down. Shoot me down? Now that's not very sociable.
my plane! Have we got a pilot on board? Come in, air traffic control. There has been a change of personnel and destination on the Meriwether jet. We are now landing at Mackenzie Field! Changing frequency, over. Browning, the cargo jet is now part of the TP Enterprise fleet. You with the max? We're here, T. Awaiting your arrival. Who are these guys? Attention, where you the jet. We're under orders to escort you to base. Change course or we will engage. Oh, are you good? Diddle yourself! Uh, Ron, I've got the fucking Air Force on me! They deploy jets! <sighs> Try and fly over them, T! Fly above them! All right! Any offensive action will be met with overwhelming retaliation. I'm landing at Mackenzie Field. We can discuss this there, on the dirt, like men. Trevor! Shit, are you okay? I saw the plane go down! I survived, and Lizard Army didn't do so well, so that's something. Ah, oh, thank God! The fuselage went into the Alamo Sea. You might be able to salvage the hardware with dive gear or something. Ah, oh, good idea! But it'll take time. Tell Oscar he ain't getting these guns. Okay. Look, I gotta ask. Are you in with the federal government? An agent, Sanchez, was round here saying you and Michael had to meet his supervisors at the garage, the cook site. Fuck, I gotta do this, okay? But I'm using them, all right? They, they ain't using me. Let's make that clear.
Oh, nice place you got here. Oh, yeah, it's easy to mock, isn't it, huh? Cheap and fucking <laughs> easy. But uh, this, this here is my place. And my work paid for my place. All right, relax. I was just being sarcastic. Yeah, well, don't be, all right? Because the world doesn't need any more sarcasm. It's the blight of the age. Yeah, I get the point. You, you don't get the point. You're like every other asshole. You made a bit of money, and you became a turd. Got yeah, news for you. I was always a turd. No! You weren't, man. You were something. But now, man, you know, you're like this place. You're a shell. Go fuck yourself. Are you some kind of pure, morally justifiable asshole? What, because you're, you're, you're totally psychotic, somehow it's okay? I'm honest, all right? You're the hypocrite. Oh, yeah, you're a fucking hero. So far above it all. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm not above ripping open your fucking chest to see what's replaced your heart. Rip it open. See what's there, baby, because I'm ready. Hello? Oh, ladies, ladies, what's up? Fuck off! Listen, I'm sorry, but we've got a problem. Government funding thing. We need you to uh, uh, investigate a research lab upstate. It's about terrorism, the big one, nerve gas, biological terror. Thank God I don't pay tax. Uh, listen, you'll need some fairly standard gear. Boat, tandem rotor heavy lift helicopter, truck, weapons. You'll have to source all of that. <laughs> Chopper alone will set you back a couple of mil. Oh, no worries there. Trevor here, he just came into a lot of money. Is that sarcasm? Oh, you're fucking A right at sarcasm. You fuck. A few weeks ago, I was happily retired, sulking by my swimming pool. And my psychotic best friend shows up out of nowhere to torture me over mistakes I made, honest mistakes I made over a decade ago. We, our little posse, are flat fucking broke. But hey, let's go out and spend $2 million on a tandem rotor fucking chopper so I can go steal nerve gas from fucking terrorists. Forgive me, you ignorant fuck. But sarcasm is all I fucking got. Sarcasm and a room full of you cunts. Yes. Woo. Welcome back, man. It is the old you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we gotta go. It's been great, but Dave here's got a Pilates class. Now, remember, ladies, you keep us way out of this thing. Bye-bye. Ah, oh, Jesus. Fucking Christ. All right. I'll give Lester a fucking call. He said he knew about something. Now, you tell him that we're driving towards Polito Bay. Come on. You're driving us up to the bank. Let me call Lester. What now? We got a funding problem, so we need a job. Before the jewel store, you talked about a score, a, a bank in the sticks. I need you to meet us there. Polito Bay, right? That's the one. I'll get on a bus. All right, Lester's meeting us there. Don't start. I won't. No way. Good call. If you're taking down a bank for a few million, first thing you do is call the hospital, tell them to get you a guy in a wheelchair. Oh, this Hayseed Bank, you gonna be carrying that kind of change? Local law enforcement extort money from all the weed farms, whorehouses, meth kitchens in the area. They keep their cash in safe deposit boxes. Then there's all the normal small town payroll stuff. We should do well. You know, I've been thinking about you, Trevor. Your lifestyle. Oh, have you? Really? Yes, I have. People always try to label you. You know? Maniac, psycho, friend, industry leader. Well, in some ways, you defy categorization. But then... What? Think about it. Where you live. Sandy Shores, you precious ass. I'm sorry there ain't a place nearby for you to get your colonics. Right. But why are you out here? It's off the grid. We're away from it all. It's somewhere real and authentic. This is America! And real people ain't been priced out yet. Yeah, well, what if it gets gentrified? 
then I'll fucking move. Okay. What about the way you dress? What about it? I don't give a shit what I wear. No, no, no. If you don't give a shit, you wear clean clothes that fit. So yours are all a little out there, you know, a little wacky. Whatever's in the shop is what I get. Jesus, what, what is this? It's not an absence of taste, T. It's the opposite of taste. You should be a stylist. And then there's the tattoos, the hair, the weird music, the funny toys, the niche drugs, the everything. What the fuck are we talking about? You are a hipster. What? You're a hipster. I hate hipsters. Classic hipster denial. I abhor hipsters. I eat them for fun. <laughs> hipsters love saying they hate hipsters. What I really fucking do? Self-hatred. Common hipster affliction. Why well, be because I'm living out here away from the bean machines and the bankers? You're gentrifying. Soon, the skinny jeans will show up, then the skinny lattes, and then the bankers. And you'll be somewhere else, starting the cycle all over again. The bus stops up here. All right. How long does it take us to get out here from L.S.? <sighs> Come on, man. Knock it off. What? Yeah. I'm gonna break your fucking fingers you don't knock that shit off. Well, please, all right? You'd alleviate the boredom. Ah, finally. Hey. 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 Welcome to paradise. Come on, car's this way. <laughs> dry out here. Don't worry, brother. Mark will take care of all your moisturizing needs. Mm -hmm. oh. Shall we? Might as well get started. <sighs> Drive us to the bank. I will go to the front of the bank, clock the entrance. If the paperwork's correct, the alarm will be a relic. We should be in and out before the local PD knows what's happening. <laughs> That's the entrance to the bank. Nothing special. Uh, take us around back. Okay. There's an empty lot behind, and no one should pay attention to us back there. I like it. I mean, the place is remote. It's got the right amount of foot traffic. This'll do. Let's check out the alarm to be sure. It's not ideal. It's gonna cost more to break that system than the score is gonna pay. Well, we're gonna have to find a new score. No, 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 uh-uh, no, no. This is the score. Right? What are our options? It's a dumb idea, but we could trigger the alarm, see what kind of response they throw out. That is a dumb idea. Hey! You heard the man, all right? Shoot the sucker. Okay, I brought my police scanner. Now drive over to the gas station opposite the bank, and we'll monitor chatter. All right. This is Toledo Base Security Services Frequency. We have a code 30 Adam. Alarm going off at Blaine County Savings Bank. All cars in the area, please respond. Toledo cars 3, 6, 9, and 1 will be there in 50 seconds. Roger that. Four units. Backup team at station is available. Uh, they've dispatched four cars in 60 You're seconds and more on standby. Guys, and it yeah? isn't even 30 Victor shots fired. Oh, this is a real headache. What do you got on the clock? 40 seconds. This is Polito Security. Any updates on the Code 30 Adam? Backup ready to mobilize. This is not normal. The response is out of proportion. Cops in this county are dirty. And the alarm just went off on their piggy bank. This is them. What is that, a 67 second response time? Yeah, four cars. More in the wings. Bad cops, garden dirty money. Fuck how many? We can take this! Wait right here. 
We'll see if anything about their routine suggests a weakness. Polito Radio, this is Polito Car 3. We have a code 12, false alarm. Possibly triggered intentionally. Roger that. We're gonna set up checkpoints on the Great Ocean Highway and the Sonora Freeway. Car to car searches and record checks. Checkpoints? Searches? Fuck this! I ain't getting caught because Lester needs a wheelchair. Hey! Wheelchair or not, we're still faster than your ass! Well, I'm not gonna outrun a cop. We've gotta go. We're going. And if we're in front of Trevor, he'll be the one running from the cops. Oh, I get it, G! Fuck! How'd they get here? What took you so long? What took you so long? Set up a board over here. Oh. Michael, man, your blood sugars are low. I'm making you some leftovers. I'm fine, T. Huh? No, oh, I'm the host, man. You know, I don't want you to get hungry and moody, right? Then you're gonna be making the wrong decisions. Man, I've been making wrong decisions my whole life. That's how I ended up here. There you go. Bon appetito. Jesus Christ, Trevor, what is that? What's wrong with you? That's just a, a what? An eyelid. It's probably not even human. Unless that gas station job. Gentlemen, some plans for your attention? Oh, good. I'm gonna stay here a minute longer than I have to. So I think our little uh, experiment showed that the response will be too quick to beat and too strong to walk through. That means you gotta face the cops head on. Dirty cops. Uh, the dirty cops head on. Head on? Man, I don't know. Well, you'll be prepared. Convoys carrying military-grade hardware pass near here to get to Fort Zancudo. I propose hijacking one and using the equipment to get an edge on the locals. I can get you the exact details of the shipment as soon as we're done here. Anyway, you won't be outside the bank too long. Polito Bay is, well, it's a bay. So you're a street away from the water where Franklin can be waiting in a boat to get you out of there. I know none of this is ideal, but it's the only way I can see of taking the score and providing for your FIB paymasters. Fine. We need personnel? Just a gunman. He'll be taking on the cops with you, so my advice, choose someone good. Ah, think about my buddy's chef, okay? Consummate professional. That it? You're sure? That should do. I'll get the equipment together. Michael, you reach out to Franklin. Trevor, mm -hmm. you do what you do. Roger that. I'll call you when we're ready to move on this. Mm, you want to bunk with us? I mean, it's gonna be tight, but you know, me casa su casa. I, I'll get a motel, thanks. Well, that's what you Fine, I'll give you a ride. Adios, amigos. Hmm? There's these redneck dudes been looking for you, homie. Some angry motherfuckers. I found where they stay, man, and I've been following them. Okay. Well, it's gotta be the O'Neill brothers. <laughs> What's left of them? I'll pick up Michael and we'll come to you. T, hey, man. <laughs> no, Chuck. We can't deal with them yet. There's too many of them. Hey, man, me and Chop on these punks. We coming up to WH, north of Chumas. All right, all right, the O'Neill brothers are coming to us. I think they was about to send one of them anti-tank rockets into your Vespucci condo, when one of your roomies told them that you was gone. Okay, so if you're on the WH, that means you'll be coming through Ratton Canyon, right? Shit, I guess. Good. Me and MT are gonna take the company chopper and meet you there. Company chopper, yes, Michael, it's a tax write-off. Frank, you still there? Yeah, I'm just about holding on to the road. We're taking the chopper and we'll head you off. Deal with these business stealing pricks on the road. Hey, dog, can you, like, get on it? Because these dudes is rolling home. 
We're five minutes out from the chopper. Hi. Fucking hell! Hell! Shit, shit, shit! Let's roll on this food, chop. Do it. Oh, shit! Trevor, man, shit, you there? There was a deer in the road, man. These motherfuckers crashed out. They crashed? They dead? No, nah, they gone. They ran into the fucking woods, man. I need air support like right fucking now. Don't worry. Incoming! Incoming? Man, you're all business. Yeah, well, this is kind of important. These men don't like me, and they know we're back in the sandy shore, so... Here she is, the big belly. Remember, she ain't mine, she's the company's. Swimming? I am too. Fuck. Man, this water is fucking cold. Boy, we closing in. Get him, chop. Fuck his ass up. I'm 
I'm the last of my kind. Don't worry, I got you. Last guy's done, homie. All right. Stay there. We'll come down and pick you up. Good, huh? Helping a friend in need? Come on, Chop. Oh, come on. Oh, yeah. Taking out some hillbilly crank dealers on a blood feud. That's what I live for. Hey, Trev, man, we're gonna borrow this and head back to town. Sure. Come on, Michael, man. I'll drop your ass off on the way back. Chop, get in. See you back at Casa Phillips, Mike. Yeah, thanks for the warning. It's me, dog. Where we at? We're at Enzo Benelli, mafia guy turned real estate developer. He's bullied his way onto half the building contracts in Los Santos. Extortion, murder, labor racketeering, you name it. There's not a construction worker in town earning a livable wage right now, and Gold Coast Development is about to go under. <laughs> and let me guess, you got a personal interest in Gold Coast, right? <laughs> Anyone think you'd done this before? Uh, according to Benelli's cell phone, he's at the construction site downtown. It's done. One small problem. My source squealed. Benelli's expecting a hit. Watch yourself and go equipped. You'll have a lot of muscle. And you're telling me to calm down? I'm going to stay near the chopper. You dumb fucks do your job.
This is private club! Any more you bitches wanna get in my way? Go to hell! Take him out! He's got a gun! Where's Enzo? Where is everyone? Get the rest of them down here right now! I'll blaze all you fools if I have to. motherfuckers get down Fuck with me, I'll lay all your all ass down. Any more you bitches wanna get in my way? He's oh. here! Get that punk! Where's Enzo? I'll blaze all you fools if I have to. We need backup. Enzo's gonna have so much balls for this. I'm putting you out of business, motherfuckers. doing it. It's taken care of, but man, that shit went south. I know. We better let this simmer now. Way too much heat. Very nice work, Franklin. Martine. Hey, look. What have you done? What have you done? 
Where is she? She's safe. Look, I'm gonna find a way to make this right with you. That will take some doing. Trevor! Mark! You know, I've been thinking about it. I'm not quite sure if I'm ready to accept an apology. Where is my wife? Patricia doesn't want to speak to you. And frankly, neither do I. I will find you! Okay. Well, I'll put some coffee on then. I'll see you soon. We did it! Lester the molester, bro! We got ourselves some military hardware. It's parked out back in my office. All right. We might be ready to move on this thing. Meet me up in the lab. It's, it's not inappropriate. It's... It's another one of your fucking disasters. That's what it is. First you take a hostage against my advice, and then you start some kind of crazy high school romance with her. Are you nuts? She's... She's a 60-year-old housewife. Wow, she's 57. And she thinks that I'm mature. Yeah, well, let me tell you something. 30 years of marriage to the world's angriest mob boss oh. would make anyone insane. You're not making my situation any easier. Oh, there's a surprise. I knew it would become about you. I miss my family. Oh, you're full of shit. All you ever did was ignore them. And now that they're gone, you miss them. Fucking incredible. I'll tell you what's incredible. Fucking incredible. Hey. You mother... Hey! Why? No! You got me out here. You wrote me into your crazy world of bullshit. If it was lies, new age shit, and arguments about how good life used to be, I could have stayed my ass in Los Santos. Hello, Franklin. What's up? All right. Here's the shot. We're going to Palato Bay, and we're going to do this thing. Any questions? Comments? Yeah. I miss Brad. If that crazy motherfucker was with us now, he would have loved this. Instead, he's got to enjoy himself molesting white-collar criminals in a federal penitentiary. Thanks for sharing. Anybody else? What about me? You'll be waiting for them by the river, handling the getaway. All right. Now, these three go in, they grab the tape, they rendezvous with you, and you get out of there. Is that a uh, work for everyone? Great, let's go. Polito Bay, let's hit this shit. You ever hit a bank before, Franklin? Yeah, I was the driver on the job my boy Lamar pulled. 
Guess it's the same kind of shit we doing now, right? Nice, bro. What was the take? Shit, I don't know, man. I can't remember. Come on. Everyone remembers their first score. Uh, shit, not me. Huh? Mikey, bro, what was your first bank score? 88, outskirts of Carcer City. Took a small franchise for 10G. Yeah, things were easier back then. Yeah, 25 <laughs> years ago. Jesus! Jeff, will you tell these gentlemen about your first job? T, man. You could just as easily. You tell them. I'll do a sanity check. Trevor, the ultimate judge of sanity. Well, it was uh, part of the interview process, I guess is how you'd call it. Trevor knew I could cook, wanted to see if I could handle myself. This cash for gold guy comes through town. It's the reason he had funds. Next thing, we're burying him and his bodyguard in the junkyard. Well, most of them, anyhow. 50K. He did fine. He's better at all aspects of the job now, from killing to dismemberment. Hey, your turn to share, kid. I told you I don't remember the details, man. Leave him alone, Trevor. This is an important moment, Michael. Here we are, on our way to almost certain death, bonding, pouring our hearts out, and this guy is sitting here, soaking it up and giving nothing in return. Hey, if he don't remember... If he don't remember? I'm supposed to trust this man with my life, and he don't trust me with the details of his first bank job? Well, how about you? Why don't you share with the group? I'm here, I'll back the facts. The checks cash place? I went in, took him for eight grand, walked out. Yeah, it was a bit more complicated than that though, wasn't it, T? Maybe I knew the guy. Maybe he ID'd me. Maybe you did six months. Maybe I was out in four, and that, children, is why we don't leave witnesses. That, children, is why you don't rob people that you know. <laughs> yeah. Franklin, Cher. Yeah, come on, kid. It can't be worse than Trevor's. All right, man, shit. Okay, the score was like two stacks, man. 2G, take home on your first gig? Uh, that ain't bad, man. Man, the whole score was two stacks. Only I didn't see none of that shit. Dive pack went off, homie. Money was useless then. Dive pack? <laughs> you amateur. I knew I shouldn't have told you shit. Hey, Franklin, we all gotta start somewhere. Last time I tell your ass something. Now, oh, come on. <laughs> Don't be so cold, man. Learn to laugh at yourself. You're in danger of turning into this man. Who, me? Yeah, you. Wouldn't laugh, wouldn't hang out. I've got my work, I've got my life. And never the two shall meet. All right, Frank, we're gonna drop you up here, okay? When you hear it kick off, Get ready, because we're gonna wanna go ASAP. I'm gonna get away, man. I'll do it. All right, you know where you gotta be? I got it down. I'll bring a die pack just for you. We ready for this? I could use a restroom break. And risk getting ID'd. You're an idiot. I gotta go! It's number two! All right, we all good? Let's hit them! If we're gonna hit it, let's hit it! This won't take a minute! Get down on the floor! Today's going one of two ways, friends. Everyone on the floor, now. You and you, out from behind the counter. That's it, hands in the air. M, keep an eye on our trusted employee. Okay, you got the crowd. Cops should be here soon, so keep an eye out. I think the door is ready. Get over here and kick it Down. in, M. Down. Ever meet this alarm guy? I'll fucking shoot him. Not if I get to him first. Yeah. Stay back! We got hostages! Shit. Tell the sheriff the 211 is confirmed. We're gonna need everything we got down here. <laughs> Sheriff's here. We never could have beaten that response. There's other ways of beating it. Move it! Call up procedure! Get the ride to the airport! 
I don't care if they surrender. I'm killing me some bad guys. Now let the hostages go, and uh, we'll talk like gentlemen. Time to face the music. <laughs> Sweet mother of shit. I gotta get through here! 
The bank robber's in the other direction! Hey, asshole! Hey, move! Move! Get out the way! Are you almost here? Nearly. Fine. You in a row, man! How many dudes they got in this private army? You hear that gunfire? That's how I'm doing. Where you at, kid? Listen to the shoot. Can't point that tough. We're holding here. So I guess we shooting our way out of here. It's getting hairy over here. It's hairy over here too, man. Chill. Oh, over here. There's a right. Good kid. Inside the group. You shot old man, huh? The group just fine. Now y'all look hot in the motherfucking suits. The platform, let's go! Shit cakes! They're all over us! Ah, it was going so sweet! If I'd known you'd be this an annoying! Come on, the way out! Use me as cover, Frank! You don't want to get out front! Take cover. I'm starting to feel underdressed, dog. Stay behind me, kid. I got the armor. I'm cool. Just keep going. Hold him down. Hey, I'm Die, you prick. Hey, Frank, you good? I'll look after myself, man. Go. So I guess we're shooting our way out of here. Team, uh, come in. I'm trying to hold these guys. Where are you? We got to do a chicken factory and get away from the tanks. How you doing back there, Frank? I'll be cool when we out of this. There's even more of these bastards. Down, assholes! Fall back! If I'd known you'd be this annoying! How many dudes they got in this private army? For fuck's sake! Look out! Grenade! Come on, come on! Let's hop the train! Come on! F, how you doing? You are going with main cover! There's a ground team on the way to the factory. I might be able to get the drop on them. All right, you do what you can do, Chef. I'm glad you got hired for the job. There's some guys trying to get in here. Chef's holding them off. Might give us the window we need to jump a train. Hey, let's get that train. I think they think there's more than one of me. Okay. Hey, slip out of town and call Lester for instructions. I got news. You're wasting the Trevor Phillips ink, my friend. Chef caught us a break, people. Let's get our train. I didn't come from the end of the warehouse. Couple more minutes. The train. It's our only shot. This is it! Let's go! Here we go. Right here. Get on! Fucking it! Let's go. Yo. Easy, easy! I'm a friendly! Agent Sanchez. Our very own corrupt G-man in training. You gotta be careful, buddy, all right? Because they are uh, looking around these trains for illegals. And if you're mistaken, you'll be shot, amigo. Very amusing. Yeah, if you expecting them two to bring you up, you're gonna be disappointed, homie. Right back at you. Got the money? Everything we got. Okay. And here's your cut. 
considering present scrutiny on public worker remuneration, this is a big win. Oh yeah, that's a huge fucking win. Woo! Monsters. I'm out. Agent Haynes will get in touch with you once Operation Save the Worlds ago. Get your crew together, okay? Fucking punk. All right. We should probably split up. They're gonna be looking for a three. Oh, the blood we spill for the security of this country. Come on, Franklin. Man, I'll holler at you home. Right. Oh, come on. Seatbelt. Serious? <laughs> <laughs>